Good day, human Latiosites. This is Latios Azuro, and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Sun Island Mock. Here we are in Melee City. Last time we took on the Totem Vicavolt up on Mount Hakulani. This time, we have to go meet Kukui in Melee Garden once again. Looks like he's got some company. Yo, yo, yo! Hold up, yo, Mr. Kukui. You say you want to make a Pokemon League? You got rocks in your skull? Four turns. Huh? Bring it on, the both of you. I've been researching Pokemon moves, yeah. So I've, I'm have i always ready, oh yeah. I'll take you both on in a battle royale and you'll be down with just a swift and incinerate or two. You gotta beat that man to be, you gotta, you gotta beat the man to be the man, boys. Yo, for real? F fine, you asked for it. Get him good, Professor. You numbskulls should learn to should learn your place. Battle Royale, huh? Nice idea there, Kukui. You can beat down three Pokemon at once, huh? It's Guzma. The boss is gracious with his presence. So this, is, I guess, is the boss of Team Skull. The hated boss who beats you down and beats you down and never lets up. Yeah, Big Bad Guzma is here. Greetings, cowering public. We have an exciting bout for you tonight. In the opposing corner, the Pokemon Professor Kukui. In this corner, the boss of Team Skull. And the hardest guy around, Guzma. Okay. Here we are, Kukui. Fellow rejects who never could become captains. We've got all these moldy old traditions and all of the, the kahunas, the captains. It's about time we cut out all the silly garbage and make something new for ourselves. Trust me, I get that. Don't get me wrong, though, Kukui. We've got no need for a Pokemon League. After all, everyone already knows who the strongest trainer is on these islands. <laughs> Speak for yourself, Guzma. It's not like I couldn't become a captain. I chose not to. I had other dreams, see? I wanted to figure out which moves would be the strong would be strong enough to beat Old Hala. And I finally found what I was looking for. The strongest moves you can use are the ones a trainer and their Pokemon choose together. In the heat of the moment when it really counts. That's when I knew I had to make a Pokemon League, yeah. To give everybody a chance to be pushed to the limit with their team and find that perfect move. Let's see it, Guzma. Show me your moves and prove you aren't just all talk. If you really can, that is. Right, Eric? Don't you agree? Ah, sure, why not? So you're one of the kids on this on his island challenge. I don't I don't look like Hollow's grandson. You don't look like Hollow's grandson. This year's Eric, he just moved to Alola recently. Discovery, new experience, and adventure. He's loving every minute of it. Eric and his Decidueye can unleash some real powerful moves. So if you think you're the strongest trainer on these islands, Guzma, why don't you battle him? <laughs> this move and this move fanatic is getting me all riled up. You've got a Z-ring, huh, kid? Why even bother with the island challenge? What's the point of it? Um. Um. Because I want to have fun. That's not an option? Okay. No, oh, well, you dumb kid. Watch closely, Kukui. Someday I'm going to destroy you. But first, I'll destroy everything you care about. Want to see what destruction looks like? Here it is in human form. It's your boy, Guzma. Okay. We're challenged by Team Skull Boss Guzma. Leading off with... What is that thing? What is that thing? What is it? I, I can't even... I'm gonna pluck at it just because I, I, I don't know. Well, super effective, but it didn't do nearly enough. 
Sword dance. No, 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 no. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, no, you don't. Give me the crit. Give me the crit. Emergency X. <laughs> oh, you just. Okay. That is actually hilarious. That thing's just gonna leave after setting up. Does it pass the plus two to the Ariados? Or. Oh dear god, we can live that. Super effective, but we can live. Okay. The Sucker Punch out. Sucker Punch? The uh, Sucker Punch? <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Alright. Let you go to level 33. Next up, he's going back into his Golisopide. Hmm. I want to go in the Dazzle. I still can't tell what that thing is, though. We are... Well, we're not technically underleveled. I like this Dragon Rage. Goodbye! <laughs> Get wrecked. <laughs> Alright, Dazzle, good job. Alright, Dazzle go to level 32. Good nice job, Dazzle. Dazzle wants to learn Nasty Plot. Not a bad choice, but then again it prevents me from static- It- setting up prevents me from switching. I usually- I would set up if it was like- if it was a competitive team, I would set up- I would want set up, but in, in a main series- well, when actually playing in the game, I don't like set up. It's just- it takes too much time and usually doesn't end up helping all that much in the end anyway, because it takes a turn to actually set up. And then you, you you feel bad switching because you lose the setup. I mean, I prefer coverage over setup. I see. Great work, I guess. Alright, got 3600 for winning. Guzma! What is wrong with you? Now's the time for, um, for your vaunted team to let loose and destroy everything! It was Eric, right? I'll remember you. It's someone I'll be happy to beat down any time. Don't mess with the boss, yo. You don't want to get you don't you don't want him to get serious. Team Skull will have to go lick their own um, lick their wounds now. Getting beat by a child just doing doing his trials. Ah, oh, Eric, you are one righteous trainer. Woo! Eric! Those were some nice moves. I can feel my soul shaking. Oh yeah, I almost forgot to give you something super important. Here you go, cousin. This is the Z-Crystal first Decidui. The evolution of Rallet that you chose. So we obtained the Decidiumite. Is it Decidium Z? Decidium Z. Not, not a Megastone, it's a Z-Crystal. Though, I think there is something to be said for Megastones being slightly better than Z-Crystals, considering they increase your stats for any move you want, and your defenses, versus Z-Crystal, which only basically doubles one move for the entire battle. So, I don't know. Z-Moves are cool, but I do actually prefer the Mega Evolutions, I think. On the other hand, though, Z-Crystals can be used by pretty much any Pokemon, versus... Mega Stones, which can only be used by set Pokemon, so, you know, they both have their ups and downs. And, uh, about that mask you've got there, Eric. Well, he gave, he gave you that, huh? I'll take it if you don't mind. I can make sure it gets back to the Mask Royal safe and sound. Sure you will. So, what happened to Lily? You lose her somewhere, Eric? I'm right here. And so is Acerola. And how is probably at the Malasada shop somewhere, right? Yeah? You and the professor fought those horrible te um, fought those horrible team skull frogs, Eric. Just thinking about it makes me worry. They sound like a scary group. You think I don't know. Changing a few moves in battle is the quickest way to get some get to know someone in my book. Well, I'm gonna head up Mount La um, Lanakila. 
Got to make sure the Pokemon League gets finished and everybody has a chance to find their own perfect move. Keep training hard on your island challenge, Eric, and one day you'll make it there. Eric, be sure you're not pushing yourself too hard. Yeah, you made it through Sophical's trial, huh? That's really great. You can take on the next trial up past Route 11, through Tapu Village, you know? If you get lost in your way, just ask a police officer for directions. They're here to serve, right? Now, Lily, you're coming with me to do some shopping. Okay, that happened. But, you know what? Do I want to give... Do I want to give Oliver to the City MZ, or keep the Grass MZ? Because I do like having Bloom Doom, but at the same time, I feel like that the City MZ could really do some, uh, some real work for us. I'm guessing this is the way we want to go. This is Route 10. This is the way we already went. So I'm guessing we want to go downward then. All right, this gets through at 11. Here we are. I wonder what kind of Pokemon are here, and you you don't battle, do you? I'm evolved from a swimmer, so I'm a hiker who can swim. Just like me, some Pokemon get another type by evolving. There's an item right here. Big mushroom, okay. Well, we could sell it. And we're going to a wild Pokemon, of course. That's okay. It's a gumshoes. I should probably actually heal up. If I had a brain, I probably would. Oh, there is a TM here. Gyro Ball! That is not really something I really need. I pref I tend to, to raise Pokemon that are slightly, you know, faster. Rather than, well, slower. But, you know, Tiny Mushroom. Okay, well. Cool. Whoa. Probably should battle. You doing those sit-ups. Okay. Alright, got a Quick Ball. That is one of my favorite Pokeballs, I must say. I do like Luxury Balls because of the design. But Quick Balls, I love the gimmick, because I love just getting, well, catching the Pokemon right off the bat. Um, hey there. Greetings, Trial Goer. Let me check your collection of Z-Crystals. <sighs> Look at that blinding yellow Electrium Z. Now, I guess I'll open the gate for you. What you face up ahead is the Ghost-type Trial. I hope you enjoy it. Another trial already? Um. Greetings, Eric. Oh, hey there. Well, Matt, I was seeking you. If you're going to travel about Ula Ula, you ought to do it um, while a stride of Mudsdale. There is no call for hesitation. Consider it my thanks for Akla Island. Alright, so Mudsdale registered in the ride pager. It was a remist of me not to register f um, her for you when we met when we met one another in Maylee. I was just so taken aback by Lily and how lovely she was that it escaped me. By no means I was just waiting for a time when you were in trouble. <laughs> If you seek the next trial, go straight on through here to Tapu Village. I'll be cheering for you on, this, on the island challenge. Alright, bye. Thank you. So let's let's register you then. Down, since we can. Um. Oh great, is this like the Rhyhorn? We got a burn heal. And there's something here. That is a Zygarde thing. It's Sina. You've collected 10% so far! 
If you'd like to know what that what this number means, please come by the Aether Base on Route 16 on Ula Ula Island. You are getting warmer. Bonus chance. We have 10%. Um, Taurus, I'll get off. Are you kidding me? If this is a fear, I'm gonna cry. Oh, it's a mud bray. Okay, well, we got one, but okay. I really want Oliver to learn Horn Leech. I really hope Oliver gets Horn Leech. Because I would love to be able to heal up. I mean, I would assume. Are you kidding me? Okay. Okay. Be that way. Be that way! You're a rising star, right? Rising star Leilani with a Turtu- Oh, okay. Now I really wish we had, um, Horn Leech. I mean, I think you're sturdy. I'm pretty sure you're sturdy. I could be wrong. In fact, I'm probably wrong. But whatever. You are definitely sturdy. Crunch. I'm not gonna avoid it. Okay. Good. I was gonna pluck, but Spirit Shackle will work. Mostly because I'm pretty sure pluck is a uh, has a faster animation. But whatever. We got this. We got this. No problem. Elixir, okay. And we're running into a wild Pokemon. Of course. Why wouldn't we? It's a Torkoal! Huh. Not even bad. Alright. Well, that is something that I definitely could have used on my team. Hmm. So I think we actually... <laughs> and a low one Geodude. Alright. That is... That is actually funny looking. Alright. No, I'm thinking that... We picked the, uh... Did we actually pick the fire type for, like, a fire island? Blush Mountain. We got another Zygarde thing. Geothermal Power Plant. Um. Welcome to the Geomer Geothermal Power Plant. Learn all about the plant. Alright. Time to rebuild our, pl uh, our plant. Time moves slow around here. You could even say we move in geological time. Okay. Free stuff. I'm here in the research the gym at the plant. Okay. <laughs> oh, Magnemite, not again. How many times do I have to tell you? You suck up all the electricity at once, we lose power, the whole place goes dark. Okay. Sorry, I hope you weren't frightened just now. The Magnemite is actually my Pokemon. I'm really sorry if it gave you a shock. Will you take this TM as my apologies? Was it Shockwave? No, Embargo. That's a weird move to randomly have, but whatever. Okay. Cool. I guess you're watching uh, a documentary about geothermal power. About a gym leader. Which, uh, there's a Pokemon trainer from somewhere far away in a region co who's called a gym leader. He's checking the heat coming from the ground with the help of his Pokemon. Huh. Could be Blaine. I may be a teacher here, but all I even understand from all this po Pokemon and Volcano is pretty amazing and powerful. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, hey, it's Samson Oak. Oh, hello. Hello, Alola. Here in the Alola region, volcanic eruptions can result in long, thin strands of magma. They form strands of glass rather than hair. 
but the hair in the Diggler here is not glass, but rather whiskers of some metallic substance. They, they use them for communication, and as a sort of sensor navigate their surroundings. Here, friend, what do you give you this? We got a lore ball. All kinds of balls. Wow, okay. I hope you'll try to complete your Pokedex for Rotom's sake as well. Oh, okay. Alright, later. Well, so I guess there's like a power plant thing. Interesting. Fired up the Pokefinder. Okay. We can zoom in if we want. Oh, cool. Alright. Taking all the pictures we can. Okay, let's pick one. Let's go with this one. Sure. Alright. We get a new record. Okay, cool. Version 3, we get 10,000 thumbs ups. Okay. Sure, let's save it because why not? No, I don't need to save it twice. I already did save it. Okay, we got a timer ball. Hey there. There is an item right here. We got a sunstone. Oh, that could be good. Oh, great. You're gonna... You really want to battle? Maybe another time. Cool. That was, um... Completely unnecessary, but still, it happened. An X attack. Okay. Cool. I'm running into a wild Pokemon. Okay. Whatever. It's all good. It's all good. We got this. I think it definitely makes sense that Oliver doesn't seem to get Horn Leech because there's no horn, but still, it would have been nice to be able to uh, get a stab physical healing uh, grass move. Secluded Shore. Oh, great, a crab roller. <laughs> of course. Of course we're running into a crab roller. I wonder if these things are supposed to be rare, because I find them so often. It's actually sad how often I find them. Whatever. Taking that thing down. I definitely should change my team's order around a little bit. Whatever, let's pick some berries. We got a cherry berry, we've got a... Cherry berry, and... Give me some variety. Lepa berry. Okay, I'll take it. Hello? Mudsdale's kind of slow, I must say. You can look, but you can't touch. Or actually, you can touch, but you can't catch. All the slowbook on the beach have are managed to protect by the Alola region. Is there a purpose for this um, beach? Well, there's a Zygarde thing. Hey. Uh, oh, they drop things, so you can use that one to find it. Cool! Here we are, Route 13. There's a house here. Oh, hey, Hal. Eric! Oh, you don't want to battle again, do you? I heard the news from Sophocles! You, you helped him out with the testing... The, with testing the kind... Yeah. The totem calling machine or whatever. 
I guess I was test subject number two, but I managed to get through the trial. Maybe even managed to get stronger. Hey, here, I want you to take this. We got a max potion. Oh, thank you. You only have one volume, don't you? Haven't you ever heard of the expression that silence is golden? Gah! He's back! Listen, Team Skull is looking for a Pokemon called Cosmog. Do you know anything? What? Not that, not that we tell you. So you do know something. Look, Cosmog isn't even a strong Pokemon, but has the potential to summon Pokemon so terrifyingly strong that you don't even know. Something like that happened. It would be a disaster for Alola. A disaster? Like, a real disaster? Then what are we supposed to do about it? Protect it. If you do know where Cosmog is, or if you do find anything out, just keep it safe. I know I might be working for Team Skull right now, so you may not trust me or care about, or care, but I'm going to tell you this just once. If you have to protect Cosmog, you have to protect Cosmog, no matter what. I still don't even understand how Team Skull found out about Cosmog in the first place. What do you mean? What do you mean, no matter what? You just gonna leave us hanging? Eric, if they're really looking for Cosmog, then is Lily gonna be okay? I don't really get what's going on, but we've just gotta keep them both safe, right? But I know what I'm gonna do. Take on my trial so I can get even stronger. I'm gonna complete my island challenge, and I'm gonna get Tapu Koka to recognize my strength, and then I'm gonna be the next island kahuna. I wanna make sure and more and more people can have fun battling to see who wins and loses. Eric, let's both try to become real champions. You know how? You just might be able to be a champion, because Kukui is building a Pokemon League, so I wish you luck. Um. Alright, vending machine. Overpriced drinks. Wow. I don't like the service here. So this is like the one on route. was it, Route 8? Aw, it's a little stuffle! Alright. You do what you gotta do. We got a moonstone. Um, there's a desert this way, it looks like. Greetings, trial goer. I'm afraid this is a captain's barricade. Only those who have the ghost type trial pass can enter. Okay. Well, I guess we have a ghost type trial coming up, don't we? Um, what the heck do you think you're doing, huh? Did someone say you could come in here? N not that I'm doing anything in here. I haven't done it. Nothing. You you want to scrap? Okay. You want to... Uh, no, 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 no. I ain't got time for you. I just beat you silly anyway. Not worth it. So, so I'll just leave you with this. Is to train up and come back when the time. Alright. You're just taunting me. Okay, I get it. Alright. Desert's like a different place every day because the winds are always moving the sand. Somewhere in that confusing mess lie the ruins of abundance. Maybe Tapu Bulu just wants to be alone? Tapu Bulu. Cool. Alright, that foreign guru. Um. Team Skull was born out of this old group that once formed around one of the old kahunas, but that whole thing fell apart after they got smacked down the, by the wrath of the Tapu. You can't know who, uh, who will get named a kahuna or not, youngun, until they are chosen. Even humans sometimes have to live at the whim of some capricious Pokemon. Okay, well, that apparently is a thing. What, you got a problem? Short stuff? I can, I, I can stand guard even when I'm squatting. Stand guard of what? Here we are at Tapu Village. Tapu Village. The village was named that because the Tapu appeared here to protect Mountain Lanakila, which reaches up so close to both the sun and the moon. But all that's left now is the name. Oh, there's got to be a photo spot here. 
No, it's not. Then what is... No, I want to go on to... There's got to be something here. What is the purpose of this? Why did I get in the Taurus? I... Okay. Look, Eric. Seems like we're almost to the Aether House. Where the captain's supposed to be, huh? Hey, look, construction workers. That must be what Kukui's talking about. So they're really making a Pokemon League up on top of Mount Latakila. The professor told me the Pokemon League in other regions have four crazy strong trainers in them that they call the Elite Four. The Elite Four in our island kahunas. I wonder which one are, ones are stronger. I can't wait to find out. Well, if they weren't built yet, I don't know. Yeah, Lola well, Pokemon League is still currently under construction. So they're building a Pokemon League. All right, well, here's a Pokemon Center. I feel like this is probably a good time to heal up. Not as good time as any, I would think. All right. It's like Grimer right here. Grime? Hey, do you have Haunter? Trade it for my Graveler if you have one. Um, I don't have one. You ever visit a Pokepelago? Actually, I have. Yeah, there are quite a few professors. You know that scientist guy named Colorus? He was bragging to me about his, how his wearables are cooled with water so they can stay comfortable. Ah, okay, cool. No pun intended. Alright. Uh, what is this way? Route 14. Um. We got a max potion. Um. This old place is actually a trial site. I can't let you in unless the captain says it's okay. Um, who's the captain? Well, whatever. Let's get the Zygarde thing. So we seriously can't go in? Someone's for taking on the next tri trial. You want rare Pokemon? Then I recommend you go find them. So, do you just have, like, uh, gumshoes or something? Togedemaru. Okay. Okay. Well. Welp. Ah, let's Spirit Shackle. Oh, that poor thing. It's kind of cute. It's obviously a Pikachu clone. Alright. Next light is Gabite. Next up is Gabite. <laughs> Sorry. Alright. Um. Well, there's really nothing that good I can do. I'm pretty sure Rough Skin is the, is the, um, the hidden ability, so. I think we're good. I'd say that's probably a rare Pokemon. So, cool. You can get some rare Pokemon. And I definitely should stop using Oliver all the time. I, I need to use more, more um, balance on my team, but we're in rain. There's a fire type on my team and we're in the rain. Well, sorry, my team is fire type and we're in the rain. So... I apologize for the, uh... That. Alright, I guess we gotta keep going this way. If that's the trial site, then we can't go here yet. Yeah, I see a flag up ahead. Hey, do you heal us? What? One of the trial guides that are here to help the kids during the challenge. But the job was I was tasked with actually to test how your skills are coming along, so... 
You can beat every trainer, every last trainer on Route 15 and come back here. This is Route 15. Race over the way to the Sharpedo. Aether House. This is where we're heading. So you know what? We're going to head into this Aether House then next time. So, thank you for watching. As always, like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time when we head in here, the Aether House. So the question of the day is going to be... Hmm. What is your favorite weather condition in Pokemon? And I will consider Sandstorm weather condition, even though Sandstorm isn't technically weather. It's basically just wind with uh, sand. But, <laughs> you know, I'll still count it. So do you, do you prefer rain, sun, hail, or sandstorm? I actually like running rain teams. Water is my favorite type, and I love running the swift swim with the, de with the drizzle. That's just, that's just me, but maybe you, maybe you like chlorophyll boosts. Maybe you like hail with an ice team. I don't know. What, what do you prefer? What do you prefer? Or you like the special D boost with the sandstorm? I don't know. So, that is the question of the day. So thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time we head in here, the Aether House. See you guys then. Goodbye.